Welcome to Electron Online. Now let's do some real examples of how to multiply and divide complex numbers. Notice that they're the same two numbers that we're either going to multiply or divide. Let's see what that looks like. Here again, it's like multiplying two binomials together. We take each of the two terms of the first and multiply it times each of the two terms of the second. And so this becomes as follows. Two times four, that's eight. Two times a minus two i, that's a minus 4i, 3i times 4, that would be plus 12i, and 3i times a negative 2i, that gives us a negative 6i squared. The next step is to combine the two terms that have an i in them, so these are two, what we call imaginary parts to the solution, and we can also convert i squared to a negative 1, so this can be written as 8, minus 4 plus 12 is a plus 8i, and i squared is a negative 1, so negative 1 times a negative 6 gives us a positive 6. And then we combine the two real parts right here, so this becomes equal to 14 plus 8i, which is the solution or the product of these two complex numbers. And notice, you get a complex number again, we have a real part and an imaginary part. So now we're going to divide one by the other. The trick again is to multiply both the numerator and the denominator by the conjugate of the denominator. So this will be multiplied times 4 plus 2i in the numerator and 4 plus 2i in the denominator. Now the numerator is going to be exactly the same as what we did here. Multiply two binomials together, or I should say two complex numbers together. Notice that this was 4 minus 2i, this is 4 plus 2i, so we'll get a slightly different result in the numerator. When we do that, we get the following, 2 times 4, which is 8, 2 times plus 2i, which is plus 4i, 3i times 4, that's plus 12i, and 3i times 2i is plus 6i squared. Now we're going to divide that by the product of these two. But again, since it's 4 plus 2i and 4 minus 2i, the middle terms will disappear, and we'll get 4 times 4, which is 16, and minus 2i times a plus 2i, which is a minus 4i squared. Now we can simplify that by combining the two imaginary parts here and converting the i squared here and the i squared there to a negative 1. So this becomes 8, 4 plus 12 is plus 16i, and since i squared is negative 1, negative 1 times 6 becomes a minus 6. Divided by, here we get 16, and since i squared is a negative 1, negative 1 times negative 4 is a positive 4. Simplifying a little bit farther, we can now combine in the numerator the two real parts, 8 minus 6, which is 2. So we get 2 plus 16i, and in the denominator we get 16 plus 4, which is 20. So this can be written as 2 over 20 for the real part, plus 16 over 20i for the imaginary part. And of course, that can be simplified, and this can be written as 1 tenth plus 4 fifths i, or you can even write it as 0 0.1 plus 0 0.8i, and all that, of course, is exactly the same thing. And that's how we multiply and divide complex numbers.